Hello dear students. Today let us see the village school master a poem written by Oliver Goldsmith. The village school master is an excerpt from a longer poem by Goldsmith called The Deserted Village. Oliver Goldsmith He he was an Anglo-Irish novelist not only a novelist but also a playwright and poet He was born on 10th November 1728 His best known novel which was appreciated and also which is till today well known the novel's name is the vicar of wakefield and he wrote a pastoral poem pastoral means uh, the theme describes about the village life the pastoral poem is the deserted village and he also written he also had written many plays the notable plays are the god natured man and she stops to conquer he done his education from trinity college dublin He passed away on fourth April, seventeen seventy four. The poem, the village school master. As I told, it's an extract of his longer poem, The Deserted Village, which was published in seventeen seventy. In this poem, the deserted village. the village is described the described village is named as obon so this could be the obon the village which was used to describe could be a modeled on goldsmith's own village lisoy goldsmith could have used obon village to represent his own village lisoy which which is in west meath ireland but that is less the description of a distinctly individual village such as lisoy then of the idea of a familiar pastoral village devastated by the lure of the city's barren solitary lamp that means the village which is explained in the poem is could be different the idea of pastoral village the typical village is is difficult to found because in 18th century in england there were many large lands pastor pastoral means the pasture you know the the animals grow animals graze the pastures asiru gavalu hullu gavalu so but late but later these pastoral villages are abandoned or they are privatized 
for building factories or for other commercial purposes the village is recalled in its old perfection with the milkmaid singing so in deserted village the the poet oliver goldsmith recalled the typical village life or a village typical typical village features what is the typical feature of village like herd lowing geese gambling watchdog baying milkmaid singing we have seen right and beautiful flowers different birds the village life is completely different from city life the village has its own identity its own beauty so but the author says that reveals that these villages these beautiful typical villages are left unnoticed as its people the villagers are migrated from from the village to the city so here in this the village school master in the poem the village school master the author recalls recalls the the qualities of his school master it is also said that at the age of 6 years goldsmith's village that is lisoy so goldsmith's village school master was thomas brain thomas brain so it could be that thomas brain is the thought it could be the thomas brain was the basis of the poem so in this poem the speaker explains expresses the potentiality the potentialities of the abilities of a school master and his his nature and his relationship with the auth- po- poet as well as with the village let us move towards the poem beside yon straggling sorry beside yon stra- straggling fence that skirts the way with blossomed firs and profitably gay there in noisy mansion skilled to rule the village master taught his little school a man severe he was and stern to view i knew him well and every trent knew well had the boarding tremblers learned to trace full well they laughed with counterfeited glee at all his jokes for many a jo- joke had he full well the busy whisper circling round conveyed the dismal tidings when he frowned it he was kind or if severe in art the love he bore to learning was in fault the village all declared how much he knew it was certain he could write and sipper too lands he could measure terms and tides presage 
and even the story ran that he could gauge in arguing to the person who owned his skill for even though vanquished he could argue still while words of learned length and thundering sound amazed the gazing rustics ranged around and still they gazed and still the wonder grew that one small head could carry all he knew but but past all his fame the very spot where many a time he triumphed is forget so there are rhyming words in each couplet couplet true lines like a way gay rule school view new trace trace and face like the days disasters in his morning face and again glee he round frowned frowned ought fault new to presage gauge skill still sound round grew new spot forget it's not spot forget grew new until let us begin the poem beside yon straggling fence that skirts the way as i told the poem is an extract a short form from his larger poem deserted village the deserted village and conveys speaker sentiments about a teacher the poet or the speaker sp- speaks about his school his school master village school master his features his nature beside yon straggling fence fence barrier beli tade beli yon over there beside over there where over the straggling fence straggling growing irregularly beside there over there what is the over there there is a fence which is grown irregularly adda diddiyagi that skirts the way skirt to pass along the edge with blossom furs unprofitably gay furs kind of a yellow flowers a wild bush a wild bush which has a yellow flowers i have given here picture of a furs which also called which is also called gorse g o r e s e so these kind of flowers grew these kinds of flowers grew on that fence blossomed blossom arali the way they blossom these kind of furs flowers yellow flowers but they are ornamental you know they you can't sell them unprofitably gay unprofitable means they won't give any money financial help so over the over the fence the straggling fence which covers with these unprofitably blossomed furs flowers gay happiness joy but these flowers gives these flowers give happiness 
happiness, the joy it gives. There in noisy mansion, skill to rule. See, skill, after that, E is omitted. The letter E is taken off and they put apostrophe and then D. It, it should read like skilled, contra, contradicted for, form. There in noisy mansion, skilled to rule. So noisy mansion, mansion, a big house. So noisy, skilled to rule. The village master taught his little school. So over the fence, there is a house, there is a noisy mansion. And there is a schoolmaster in that house. Schoolmaster teaches. Noisy. Why it is noisy? Because of teachers teaching activities. While teaching, surely there, there would be sound. So in, no, in this noisy mansion, skill to rule the village master taught his little school. Village master, master, the word master denotes that the respect which he gets from his students as well as from villagers. A man severe he was and stern to view. So, in the first four lines, it is described that where, where the school is located. And now, in these lines, the physical appearance of the schoolmaster is explained. A man severe he was and stern to view. So, how is the schoolmaster? The schoolmaster is severe discipline. Severe, serious, but here he was a severe man. He was a very disciplined, stern, firm. To look his his physical appearance appeared like he was a he is a strict and discipline disciplinarian person. I knew him well, and every truant knew. See. The author, sorry, the speaker knew him well. How? The speaker knows him well. And every truant knew. Truant, absentee, non-attender. A pupil, a student who stays away from school without leave or explanation. Absentee. So, uh, it means uh, the, the student the author, the poet, the speaker or the poet could have absent for the class. I knew him well and every trend knew, every like, like the poet, other absentee students also knew him. Well had the boarding tremblers learn to trace so our shaking appearance tries to find out trace find out trembler shaking naduka to feel fear or anxiety to shaking involuntarily i knew him well and every train knew well had the boarding tremblers Learn to trace the day's disaster in his morning face. So, he could have been absent to the class, absent to the class, the speaker. So, he knew that very well. What is his anger? What? How does the schoolmaster behave? Behaves when? 
when these children were absent to the school well had the boarding tremblers learned to trace they they knew they could trace out they could find out by seeing his face by seeing the school masters village school masters face they would they would grasp that how how it would be how it their day will be they can they can anticipate anticipate they can anticipate by seeing his face 